residents of Namirembe Flats, Kampala Central Division, together with Kampala Capital City Authority, awoke to cleaning and disposing of this garbage, which had been piled at this collection center for months. The accused Nabugabo Abdil, a company contracted by KCCA to manage waste, of collecting garbage from different centers and dumping it at their collection site. They say the garbage is rarely collected. This garbage, people are saying it has accumulated for six months. It's not six months. Even for, it has been there for almost years. They just take off a little and the other down part remains. We only get services twice a month and their cars are always broken. So we, 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 we face this problem of too much garbage in the area. But according to Nabugabo Abdil, the garbage center was officially closed after the sale of the premises. So the community within that area continued to dump garbage in that particular place. But we couldn't access that place because uh, it's now a private property. The city authority officially banned the indiscriminate disposal of waste and rather established that the community resorts to private garbage collecting companies. Now Kampala Capital City Authority is right now reviewing the Memorandum of Understanding. It signed with Nabugabo Abdi to incorporate clauses that will closely monitor the quality of services that the company offers to the community. KCCA is also exploring other avenues including opening the garbage collection business to the private sector for better service delivery. I would encourage any businessman in town to mobilize resources acquire vehicles and come and sit down with the authority so that we can agree on how we can partner to enable them collect garbage and improve on sanitation and hygiene. KCCA is also anticipating a $10 million project funded by the World Bank to promote proper solid waste management and recycling. Solomon Serwanja, NTV Weekend Edition.